Number 41, subtract the last word in the name column as last name. So Star Wars pipe. Uh, we'll do a mutate on this one. Mutate last name, name our new column, equals And another string R function, string extract. And from the name column, we want to extract, we'll use a regular expression here, uh, slash slash, backslash backslash B is a word boundary, so we want to space between, space before a word. And then W is a word, and occurrence of the word, and dollar sign is the end. So extract the last word between the last word boundary and the end of the string. So the last name. Pipe that in. And we'll just select name and last name. So Luke Skywalker's last name is Skywalker, C3PO is 3PO, Leia Organa, Luke Starklighter, Kenobi, so on and so forth. 42, find all names that end with a vowel. Well, That one we can say Star Wars, and we'll type this in. We'll filter, and we'll do a string dot detect, string underscore detect name, and we want it to end with. So we'll put the string. In square brackets, A E I O U or A E I O U. So if it ends with close the brackets, dollar sign for the end. So if it ends in any of those characters, it will be detected, filtered, and returned when we select the name column. And doesn't like the name. Oh, uh, so let's put that one in a table so we can see it better. We're not sure on, can't really be sure on that one. So GT pipe and GT, and we'll choose a new theme this time, Excel. We have to pipe our okay. There's a little Excel table name C3PO, not zero, it's an Organa, Kenobi, Chewbacca, Solo, Greedo, a lot of them. But we got all the ones with Mace Windu, one of my favorites. They got a lot of we got all of them with the AEIU uh, regex. So find the home worlds that start with K. I know there's one or two, but I can't remember what they are. I think Chewbacca. So Star Wars. And this one I'm going to filter out the Isnos because there's a, a lot of them. So we'll say not Isna, anything that's not in A. In homework column. Then after that, we'll pipe in 
the mother filter, string detect, and home world, and this one is the hat is begins with. So hat K. We'll assume it's capitalized since it's a world. And then we'll just select home world. And so we're going to get a lot of those. We will type that in and select distinct. And let's go ahead and add our GT to that. All right. Not select distinct, it's just distinct. My bad. So the distinct home worlds that begin with a K. Tashik, that's the Wookiee world. Camino and Kaylee. All right. Number 45. Select name, height, and mass. Column from centimeters to meters. So select name, height, and mass and convert the height column from centimeters to meters. And save the database as a new object called a new hope. All right. So, Star Wars. Height. Name, height, and mass. Pipe that in. Convert the height column from centimeters to meters. So mutate, convert, height, height in meters, so height divided by 100. Height equals height divided by 100. All right, so do that. So height is now instead of 172 centimeters 1.72 meters so we've done that next problem oh we need to save the data set as a new hope so we just say a new hope um, alt minus for our equals zero a new hope assigned to star wars select name height mass and mutate height to divide by 100. So to see that, we can say a new hope. I'm going to bring it down a line. Oh, we first have to run a new hope. Now we can see a new hope. Okay, there's our a new hope. Tibble 87 by 3. With name, height, converted to meters, and mass. The next column says, take a new hope. Next, number 46, take a new hope. Make a BMI column using the BMI index formula of mass in kilograms divided by the height in meters squared. So we'll say a new hope. Height that in. We're going to mutate. Just add in a column. Uh, BMI equals mass divided by height. Hat 2 is squared.
And let's uh, go ahead and arrange that, order it by desk BMI, BMI descending. And then let's run that. All right. Let's go ahead and see that in a nice table. Let's bring this down. Kind of like this is Excel format. So there's a nice table, name, height, mass, body mass index. Java is just huge. I'm going to try to keep these to around 10 minutes. That's enough for this section. This is the way.